Ah, you're here. I want to erase all demons from Tokyo and return this city to what it used to be. Would you lend me your strength so I can accomplish that goal? Thank you. Ha! <laughs> Glad to have you on the team! Alright, let's go over our plans for tomorrow. The Maiden said if we can prepare the song, she'll tell us how to reach the server. Right. We should go see the Maiden once the sun's up. We also need to see Haru first to make sure the song's been completed. And once Haru's song is finished, we can finally go to the server. That should be the case, yeah. Tomorrow's gonna be one tough day. Oh, everyone. Here's where you all are. Cress... No, wait. Miss Mari? <laughs> I've been thinking about a lot of things since then. I've gone around and heard about what you're all trying to do. I want to help you out. See? I have a comp too. Thank you. I'll do my best for you. Looks like it's all settled then. Tomorrow's the final battle, so get plenty of rest. Today's the last day. Unless we get the demons out of here by 1800, this city's sunk. I wonder if Haru will make it on time. Hey, don't fret. She'd never let us down. But we should find out where she is. It'd be pretty lousy if we missed each other. Uh, so we're looking for Haru first, and then going to see Amane, right? Huh? You're... you're that demon from before. He said yes, Frosty! Good for you! <laughs> uh, we're bringing a demon along on our mission to get rid of demons? Now I'm really confused. Oh well. We'll be counting on you, Frosty. Okay, first of all, this guy ain't a samurai. Nippon Bugeikon. I'm sure she's here. Yo, Haru. How's it going? Oh, you're here already? Isn't it early for a night owl like yourself? Funny what a demon invasion will do for your sleep pattern. How's the song going? Don't worry, I've been working on it. I need a few more hours. Don't rush me. <laughs> Sorry about that. You know best. Yep, just leave it to me. Alright, now we know for sure where Haru is. Next up is Amane. I finally found you. Huh? Is Zuna? Listen to me. We're in some trouble. Huh? The deadline's been cut short. They plan to use the final option at 1300 today. Comps are so widespread now that all our blockades are under attack. Our team's trying to negotiate for more time, but we have an uphill fight on our hands. No way! Th that means we only have four hours left! I know. I'm going to try everything I can. I wish you good luck with your mission. No, this is awful. How are we supposed to do this in just four hours? Well, I'll just have to pick up the pace, huh? Why the long faces? There's no time to sit around and sulk, is there? I'll keep it up on my end so you guys do your best too. That Haru. <laughs> she seems like a different girl than she was yesterday. She's right, though. We can't waste any time. Let's hurry and go see Amane. We found the song that'll send demons back where they came. It needs a little more time to be finished, but it'll be ready before the deadline. So, you ready to cough up the location of the server? I understand. We angels do not lie. I shall tell you true, the path leading to the server. There is a slight problem. The deadline's been cut to 1300. I am aware. Let us not delay in moving toward the server. A number of conditions and processes must be met before you may access it. Yes, let us settle those first. As you know, the War of Bell is underway and you are already involved in it. 
For your wishes to be granted, you must defeat the remaining bells to become king. I will explain. The final trial to assume the throne of Bell is to face the entity known as Babel. It was formed from the high concentration of energy lost by the original Bell. The summoning server you seek is Babel itself. W wait a sec, Babel? Like the Tower of Babel? From the Book of Genesis? That's the server controlling the demon summoning program? Yes, that is correct. Babel currently sleeps within the server, awaiting one who may become the King of Bell. Only one worthy of becoming the King can summon and awaken Babel. The server is currently located in the demon world. The server did once reside in this world, but the Shomonkai transferred it to the demon world. Belbereth tricked them into believing it would improve the summoning program. Belbereth's aim was to use the server as a medium through which to manifest Babel. Babel is in the demon world, but having no corporeal form, it cannot be seen or touched. Belbereth contrived a way to give Babel a physical body in order to challenge it. But, but why the server? Wouldn't something else have worked? The server harnesses the flow of thoughts. Its user can bend it to his or her will. And Babel... A mass of sentient energy is very close in nature to human thoughts. Belbereth likely decided that the server would be ideal to interface with Babel. That is correct. Belbereth has brought Babel into the server he holds in the demon world. He is most likely keeping it there within close reach. Then Belbereth already has Babel. Yes. However, Belbereth is still participating in the war for the throne of Bel. This proves that Belbereth is not yet worthy of becoming the king of Bel. The word Babel originally meant King's Gate. Thus, the final objective in the war of Bel is to gain the vast power sleeping in Babel. I don't know what to say. This is way out of my league. I get what's going on, but how does someone become worthy to become the king of Bel? If we can't do that, then in the end... We have no way to reach the server. You must emerge victorious in the war for the throne of Bell. Gather the fragmented power of Bell to augment your inner Bell, and you- Then, he has no choice but to become the king of Bell. So if he's not qualified to become king right now, we'll have to defeat the other Bells out there, right? Correct. Of the remaining Bells, Belbereth and Belzebul seem to be near the server. First, however, there is another Bell very near to you. Yes, Jezebel is inside Amane, inside this very body. H hey, wait, you're inside that body too, and you're an angel. Wouldn't it be faster if you beat this Jezebel thing? The reason I have revealed myself to you and speak to you now is because you were all chosen as representatives of mankind. I lend you my strength because you attempt to withstand this ordeal by your own strength. If you fail in this, Amane's consciousness will be no more, and Jezebel will be incarnate. You have gained the power of two bells, and you have a comp as well. These things together with my assistance will make this possible. I will be waiting here. When you are ready, return to this place. But our time is limited. Amane's soul is already being slowly dominated by Jezebel. I am keeping her in check for now, but I cannot manage it much longer. Go, prepare yourselves to battle Jezebel and return to Sheba Park. You have returned. You are prepared for battle then. I will send each of your minds into Amane. Defeat Jezebel and free Amane's soul. Our minds? Is that safe? We're not gonna die by mistake, right? Be at ease. His enhanced power from defeating two demons of Bell. It, your comps, and my guidance as his messenger will protect you. Is that how it works? Then we'll be counting on you.
Do not allow demons to cloud your heart. Keep a firm grasp on yourself, and it will be no different from the real world. Amane's soul is already in the process of being dominated by Jezebel. It is possible that her soul may oppose you. Please be very careful. You must make Amane regain her consciousness. She will then undoubtedly aid you in battle. Amane's consciousness? Okay, got it! If your souls fall to evil, you will never again be able to return to this world. I will help you as well, but you must be extremely vigilant. Now go. May his divine protection be with you. <laughs> this is what the world of a person's mind looks like? I can move, and things here feel solid, too. Huh, it's not as different from reality as I had thought. But I'm not looking at your and his actual bodies, right? Hey, it's just our souls here, right? If we lose to Jezebel and our souls don't return, what happens to our bodies? Uh-uh. Come on, this isn't playtime. Let's get this done and get out before we end up ghosts. Look! It's Amane! Amane! <clears throat> Amane! Can't you hear me? Hmm? What the... Where's that voice coming from? Stupid old hag, you're not killing anyone! <laughs> Come on, Amane! Don't give in to a demon like this! It's your soul! allow myself to be bound anymore. 
Jezebel. I won't be controlled by you. This is my soul. Uh, Hamane! Are you okay? You look like you're hurting. I feel faint. She took more of my power than I imagined. Be wary. Amane's soul grows weaker every moment. The next time she's possessed will be her last. She will not have the power to resist. What do you mean by that? If Amane's soul is possessed again, she will belong forever to Jezebel. Your souls too will be trapped where you stand. Protect Amane. Thank you very much. You've saved me. If I'd stayed like that, my soul would have been utterly consumed by Jezebel. Now, I will lend you my assistance. Return to the real world. It seems we've all returned safely. Thank you very much. Didn't feel like I was in your mind, but it is good knowing I'm back in reality. Now then, that angel inside you made us a promise. Tell us how to get to the server. It said whatever bell demons are left are near the server. If you don't show us the way soon, I'll think twice about believing what you say. Please, be at ease. Remiel spoke to me a moment ago. Though I am once again in control of this body, a promise is a promise. I won't renege on the vow that Remiel made with my lips. You know that the demon lord Belbereth, the one my father worships, has the server, yes? Yes, that is correct. As a result, neither humans nor angels such as Remiel can access the server. To approach the server, we must remove the wall dividing the demon world from our own. Remove the wall? Yes. This is why Remiel and I kept the path to the server closed until we could be certain. It's a heavy gamble that puts this world's fate at risk. <sighs> We will now defeat the four devas protecting this world in order to corrupt Tokyo. I will explain that now. Do you believe Tokyo at this moment is no different from the city you've always known? The appearance of demons is one thing, but even that aside, Tokyo is not as it once was. We are not the first to begin the corruption of this city. The corruption of Tokyo was slowly ongoing, even before this lockdown began. Whether we do this or not, Tokyo will eventually be subsumed into the demon world. Since becoming the capital, Tokyo had been protected by the four devas. The corruption began as the Shomonkai defeated a deva, letting them summon demons. That is correct. Is that the whole business about you borrowing Jezebel's power to defeat it? Yes. At that time, I was unable to hear Ramiel's voice. I believed in my father's teachings, that carrying out his wishes would save people. If only I had been able to hear Ramiel's voice much sooner. I see. That explains why demons could be so easily summoned. Indeed. Of the four devas protecting Tokyo, three remain. Currently, even if he were to make himself worthy to become the King of Bell, 
Babel would not be able to cross from the demon world to our world. We must defeat all of the remaining devas and remove the barrier protecting Tokyo, or it will be impossible to call forth Babel, the summoning server. This is nuts! To get rid of the demons using the server? We have to destroy the barrier and corrupt Tokyo? Kind of a we had to destroy the city in order to save it type of thing? Some gamble. That all depends on us. If we fail, Tokyo... No. The entire world will be corrupted. Demons will be able to walk at will between the worlds without the summoning program. What awaits humans then is certain destruction. But the spread of the summoning program has led to vast numbers of demons in the city, completely destroying the balance between the worlds and hastening Tokyo's corruption. If this continues, it will be only days before the imbalance crushes the human world. This seems to be one reason the angels are watching the lockdown so intently. <laughs> Looks like we don't have a choice but to do this. We haven't much time left. We must defeat the remaining devas today. Damn it! Alright, fine. We'll do it. So? Where do we go to meet these remaining devas? I sense the fiercest of them to the north. He awaits at a large temple near Ikebukuro. We're going for the strongest one first? Th that's not the normal order. A big temple near Ikebukuro. That'll be Eikokuji. Let's hurry. Ah, look at him. He's barely phased by any of this. We must make the best of a bad situation. I'll lend you what little strength I have. This is the place. Welcome to Eikokuji. I'm getting nervous. I don't really know much about these four devas. If I'd known this would happen, I'd have paid more attention during the school trips. <laughs> That's a good attitude. You should remember that even after the lockdown's over. Wait a sec. Were the four devas enshrined at Eikokuji? That is correct. This temple is dedicated to Nyoirin Kanon. However, the devas are likely using the power accumulated here to compensate for Jikoku's loss. Don't tell me you're the type who studies during summer vacation, too. Um... Is it really okay to defeat the four devas? Yeah, it has to be done. If we don't connect this world with the demon world, we can't reach the server. Now enough John. Let's go. As I thought, Bishamon, strongest of the four devas, protects this place. Yes. Let's begin. We harbor no animosity, but this battle is inevitable. I'm sorry, but we can't lose either.
Yeah, there's no turning back now. Pretty heavy. What is this? The sky. The air has gotten heavy. Is this... The power dividing the worlds has weakened further. Thus hastening Tokyo's corruption. So it's getting worse, huh? Oh, it's cause we beat Bishamon! Let us be on our way. We cannot stop here. We must connect the worlds, reach the remaining bells, and then babble itself. I know, we have to do this. We've gone too far to stop. Two devas down, two to go. Where to next? The south, to Shinagawa. It seems to be another temple. Shinagawa. Could it be at Sengakuji? Come on, let's go. Sengakuji, a temple dedicated to Shaka Nyorai. This is definitely the place. The next of the four devas is here? Yes, the remaining gods are Zocho and Komoku. But the atmosphere is hazy, and I cannot tell which of them is lurking here. Bishamon was supposed to be the strongest, so I'm a little less worried about this one. I don't know. I have a bad feeling about this. There's no time for questions anyway. Here goes. F from behind, too? I knew something was up!
Sorry, Devas. We'll take good care of Tokyo in your place. With the Devas gone, the world should be connected, right? So, where's the server? Don't think we'll need to. Take a look at that. <gasps> There's a hole in the sky. It looks like the eye of a typhoon. That horrible, malicious thing. Is that a swirl of magical power? The two worlds are joined. The portal to the demon world has been opened. There are no more obstructions. Well, wait a sec! You're telling us now that we gotta go to the demon world? Don't worry, that won't be necessary. We can summon Babel through that portal. I'd say it looks to be around Rapongi. Is that where we're going to next? Hey, is this okay? We won't get sucked into the demon world if we go there, will we? If we wait too long, the demon world will swallow ours. It would be best to hurry. Wait a moment, please. It seems Remiel has something to tell you. Hmm. I see. To delete all the demons, we will need the Song of Return. Is that prepared as well? Babel, the King's Gate, is one with the Demon Summoning Server. Infusing Babel with the song should send all demons back to their world. And once he becomes the King of Bell and orders Babel to close the gate, this will end. The demons currently in Tokyo passed through Babel before gaining physical form. The song may send them back, but the open gate means the demons can return at any time. Unless the King's Gate is closed, this tragedy will repeat itself. I see. And how do we do that? I... I don't know. Remiel didn't tell me everything. It must be the angel's will that humans search for the means ourselves. Damn it! So it's the silent treatment again? They do this every time we need them. Angels are normally forbidden from rendering assistance to humans during an ordeal. Remiel has given us important information. We should be grateful. Now, we must defeat the remaining bells and summon Babel. Let us hurry to Rapongi. Are you all ready? H hey Hmm? Do you need to use the restroom? No, you idiot! Jeez! We don't have much time until the government's deadline, right? I thought it might be a good idea to get some insurance before we go to the server. Oh! You have a point there. It might be best if we told Izuna and Fushimi about the plan. It might be possible to have them delay the final option. Yeah, let's have Azuna and Fushimi buy us all the time we can get. It will delay us somewhat, but we cannot ignore anything that might help us succeed. All right, let's go find Azuna. <sighs> you kids. Hi, Azuna. We need to speak with your commander. Is that possible? It's urgent. Commander Fushimi? Okay, give me a moment. I'll see what I can do. Sorry to make you wait. What did you want to tell me? My god, is this true? Alright. I'll trust you. But if what you say is true, you may be able to get rid of every demon in Tokyo. Hmm. I'll send an order to the SDF operating the lockdown to abort the final option. It should confuse the chain of command enough to buy you some time. No guarantees, though. Oh, no, we're really grateful. Seriously, thanks. We don't want to die, but we can't put everything outside the lockdown in danger. <laughs> I thought before you were just children, but I'm honored to know you. Captain Izuna. Yes, sir. Did you call for me? You can use a comp, yes? Go with these children and give them your full support. Yes, sir. I don't know what I can add to such a well-oiled machine, but I'll do my best. It seems we're done here. Now, let us retrieve the one who will sing the Song of Return. Oh yeah! I wonder if Haru's finished. You just watch. 
I bet she's done already and bored silly waiting for us to get back. Haru, how's the song going? Done yet? Ugh, damn it. Just a little more. I'm almost there, but... The song that Aya left me is divided into tracks. I need to sequence them properly, but I'm missing a track. I mean, it's in here, but... What do you mean? You don't have to hide it, just tell us. When I looked at the files, one of them wouldn't open. It keeps saying data corrupt. Well, you just need it fixed, right? Well, go for it, Atsuro. That's your thing, isn't it? Um, no. I can't even use my laptop. Give me a power source and maybe so, but... But... Then what are we gonna do? We came so far! Make an entire track from scratch? <laughs> That's just impossible. Even if it's impossible, we have to do it. We can't lose any time here. Don't be ridiculous. Aya was a genius. No one could possibly mimic what she did. Haru, Aya always told me that someday you'd outshine her. <laughs> Where did that come from? Spare me the comforting lies. Why do you think Aya quit being Diva's vocalist? <laughs> because she hurt her throat and... Her throat was fine. She told me not to tell you this, but it's the truth. <sighs> then it was to make me sing? Th that's a lie. You're lying. All of it's a lie. That's enough. She left that song in your hands. Who else is going to do this but you? Haru, I'm begging you. She would have wanted it this way. <laughs> you big softy. <laughs> I'll tell you right now, I'm not taking responsibility for what happens. <laughs> then you can do it. <laughs> you have to ask? You're the one who told me to do it. Luckily, I've heard this rhythm track before. It's odd, but the sequence sounds a lot like the first song I ever wrote. <gasps> the song I wrote? Haru? What's wrong? This... this chord progression. It is my song. The very first song I wrote with Aya's help. Oh, I remember now. It must have been over a year ago. Aya was all excited, saying you had a gift for songwriting. Said if it was arranged well, it'd be better than her own stuff. Is this the song? That sounds about right. But damn, the arrangement was so good, I didn't even notice. This is perfect. She... She finished it so well. Now that I know what it is, I can remember what the missing track sounded like. Looks like she was a cut above all of us. I never thought it'd be your song. How about it, Haru? Now do you believe it? Aya really did acknowledge your talent. Aya... 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 Haru, can you do it? Hell yeah, I can do it! Watch. You watch, I'll do it, no problem. Aya is alive inside you. You don't need to look for her anymore. You just need to play your own music. Enough with the speeches. I've got work to do. There isn't much time left, is there? Go on ahead. I'll catch up later. Miss Harusawa, we'll head for Apongi. Please, meet us at the hills when you finish. All right, I'll be there, so hold on until I arrive. Oh, and don't call me Harusawa. I'm Haru, the lead singer of D.Va. <laughs> I think the song is in safe hands. Now, let us make for Opongi. Everything will be decided at the top of the hill's tower. The final battle draws near. Yeah! Right, let's go! We're gonna save Tokyo! The hills, epitome of modern society, a present-day Tower of Babel. We should be able to reach Babel from its highest floor. Whoa. First, we got company. I never want to be this popular with demons again. <laughs> Belzebul is considered the right hand of darkness. He may rival Belbereth in strength. Gross! It's a fly! I don't do well with bugs. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> Should one wish to become King of Bell, a fight with him is inevitable. To open the door to Babel, you must defeat him. I didn't think something like that would be waiting for us. <laughs> That's the guy I know. <laughs> You're way too calm about this. He's beaten four Bell Demons now. The only one left is... Only Bellbirth remains. Isn't that the god of the Shomonkai? Yes. The closer we come to Babel, the more determined Bellbirth will be to stop us. The same goes for my father as well. But, won't that mean Amane has to fight against her father? Yes. I have no qualms. Once Belbereth is beaten, my father should come to his senses. Oh, then I guess it's okay. But, why did the Shomonkai start worshipping Belbereth in the first place? This will take some time to tell. Is that alright? My father foresaw the coming of God's ordeal while he was a student in theological school. Do you know the story of the Tower of Babel in the Old Testament? Long ago, mankind put their skills together to create a tower reaching to the heavens. However, that act broke God's commands, and he brought his wrath down upon it. And as man's common tongue was divided into many languages, so were people's thoughts. But today, Technology allows us to overcome language barriers and rise high in the air. I am referring to the way new technology allows for the construction of skyscrapers. That being said, the Tower of Babel itself was not what angered God. Huh? God was truly grieving for mankind's hearts. At the time, all the people of the world gathered under a single king. A king leads the will of many. If he did evil, his people would blindly follow. God grieved for such weakness in the hearts of humanity. My father knew this, and his fear of God's ordeal grew ever stronger in recent years. In this day of instant worldwide communication, one's voice can have the act of disseminating one's will to the masses is not the privilege of a king anymore.
So, that's progress. Anyone can easily broadcast vast amounts of information out into the world. Conversely, anyone can find any information they could want, even if this information is malicious in nature. True. I've noticed that myself. Not that many people believe everything on the internet anymore, but some still do. The gullible ones end up spreading false information far and wide. That's probably how a lot of stupid urban legends get started. Incorrect information may not pose a huge threat, but knowledge of things such as how to make bombs, or how to steal, or how to kill, this can all be found on the internet, if you know where to look. I see. People do bad things because they know how to. They won't be able to otherwise. Indeed. Not all humans are capable of resisting the temptation for wrongdoing. Also, the more people become involved in virtual lives, the more secluded they get. They would rather hide themselves within comforting lies than face reality. If mankind continues to stray from the path of virtue, God will surely judge us for it. And humanity, so dependent on technology, may lack the strength to endure his ordeal. Thus, to save mankind, my father turned not to the God currently ruling the heavens. Instead, he turned to another being, one that had been a god in the past. The original bell that lost its battle against God was split into multiple bells, of which Master Belbereth is said to retain the most power and the original memory. That is why his desire for revenge against God and lust for power are so great. Master Belbereth's goal is to take back the power of Bell from Babel and battle God. That is probably why he answered Father's call to stand up to God's ordeal. My father wanted to prevent another judgment of God. The two shared a common interest. I see. So Belbereth responded to your father's wish and lent him his strength. Thanks, Amane. I think I kinda get it now. With Belzebul defeated, there is nothing to prevent us from reaching the highest floor. That's right. Let's hurry and... Oh! Hey, that reminds me, the elevators, they aren't working, are they? Oh, right, no electricity. That's not going to work. Ah, uh, so we have to walk all the way up there? That's going to take forever. Wh why are you taking it out on me? Hmm. Miss Harusawa will be fine. She'll make it in time. <laughs> I know that. If I don't believe in her, who will? Oh, there you are. C Commander Fushimi, what's wrong? I gave the order to abort the final option. It worked. The operation's in chaos, but I doubt it'll last for more than 90 minutes. Yeah, we only had until 1300 before, so 90 more minutes is more than enough. Don't get too excited. I can't promise you those 90 minutes either. I've done all I can. The rest is up to you. 1430. You have to end all this by then. Roger that. Leave it to us. Now, we have a little more time, but not much. Let's get prepared and move on. At last, we're proceeding to the final battle. Once we begin our climb, there will be no time left to come back down. Are you ready? Haru, come on, girl. Don't tell me you're not gonna make it. Jen, we can't wait any longer. We need to start heading up. That Haru woman hasn't arrived yet? You all go on ahead. I'll tell her to head up after you once she comes. I can't let you do that. There could be demons still roaming around. You wouldn't be able to hold them off. It's true that I don't have the powers that you all do, but don't underestimate my desire to save this city. Compared to leaving the job to civilians while I bow out, my life is a small price to pay. <laughs> so you're another idiot, just like us. Don't you know heroes are out of fashion? We'll leave this place to you. Don't die on us. Got it? And the same to you. I wish you good luck. The time has come. Can I really counter Naoya's program? I know I can. I have to, or I can't save everyone. I'm... I'm going to surpass Naoya. We're gonna save Tokyo! Heroism, here I come! Let's do our best! I 
I may not be strong on my own. But when combined with the rest of you, I'm infinitely stronger. Let's go! If my powers can help you save the world, I'll be very glad. Let's do our best. I have to say, I only made it this far thanks to you. Let's end this lockdown. You've always been at my side, helping me out. Now I... I want to help you. Let's do our best, until the very end. I, uh... I'll save the city you loved with the song you left for us. Let us ascend to the top floor. Babel will appear there. Ugh, I'm so tired. Stupid power going out, making us use the stairs. This sucks. Is this the thanks we get for trying to save the world? Stupid lockdown! Yeah! <laughs> uh, hero shouldn't give up so easily, you know? Uh, my legs are turning into jelly. I never said I wanted to be a hero, damn it. I just want to upload Haru's song to the server. Why do I have to go through this? Hey now! I know you all want to be, um, heroes! Come on! Let's uh, do this! I... I see how much we rely on... technology. I wonder if I can fight... when we get up there. Huh? Oh, are we at the top? Ah, oh, you got it. Hey, what's this place? This is the top floor of the hills, right? It looks like a chapel. Is this a Shomunkai facility? Hey, look at that pipe organ. Isn't that a console panel? Maybe we can access the server from here. Hey! Is that somebody over there? Amane, why are you with those people? Know your place! You are a maiden of the Shomunkai! Father... You do realize how evil their true intentions are, don't you? Those blasphemers taint this room of descent and conspire to stop the ritual! Not only did you help them, you led them here! Have you gone out of your mind? Father, I... I have heard the voice of the angel Remiel. I've told you this before. Destroying God isn't the only way to overcome his ordeal. The Shomunkai's teachings brought the ordeal upon us. And look at the city now. Is this the world we hoped for? Is this what the Shomunkai set out to create? If this is how you wanted the world, Father, then I don't need the Shomunkai teachings. Fool! I didn't expect my own daughter to be so naive. What you're trying to do will merely prolong God's ordeal. If we don't banish the source of the problem, the ordeal will only repeat itself. That is why humans must now surpass God and create a world without God, the Tower of Babel that will never again crumble. All of you gathered here, heed my words. I have sounded the warning bell against the coming ordeal of God. And now, I will forfeit my life to save mankind. Witness my ultimate sacrifice! <sighs> Father, what are you... I will invite Master Belbrith to this world, thereby overcoming God's ordeal. No one will stand in my way. Now, Master Belbrith, eat my flesh. My soul and my life descend upon our world! My price is only that you defeat God and bring about a world free of his ordeals! <laughs> oh, raging God! Our Majesty, Master Belbereth! Oh! <gasps> 
It's Master Belbereth! Master Belbereth has descended! Oh, our god, Master Belbereth! We praise thee! <laughs> Father, where is my father? <laughs> no, father. We will cut off the walkway leading to the altar. All right, I'll do it. You scum! You'll have to go through me if you want to harm Master Belbereth! You will feel the full force of our exalted Lord Belbereth's power! to survive, no matter what. Hmm? So that's where they're controlling the walkway. Maybe we can use it too. My demons! Give in. If I can just make that comp go out of control.
money. Even though his methods were wrong, he only wanted to save people. He wasn't bad. Yeah, if anyone's to blame, it's Belbereth for taking advantage of him. It's always the humans who end up getting hurt. The angels and demons aren't fair. Father, I won't give up. I will save mankind with these people. I'll save them, no matter what happens. Uh, oops. Am I late? Haru! Sorry for the wait. The song's done, so I'm here to deliver it. Hmm? <laughs> hey, you. You can keep going, can't you? What? I don't know what exactly happened. But you've still got life in your eyes, so you can keep going, right? Chin up. Cry and scream if you want to, but press onward with all your heart so you have no regrets. Miss Harusawa, you're right. I don't have time to mourn right now. I've got to keep going with all that I have. All right, you're looking better already. <laughs> don't call me Harusawa. A woman's emotions really are like a roller coaster. So how's the new song, Haru? It's awesome, of course. But the sequencer's batteries are almost dead. We're going live without much practice. Thanks. I'll make sure it lives up to your expectations. <laughs> Looks like Haru's back to her regular self. I've got nothing to worry about. You have defeated all the bells, meaning you can become king. Babel will appear once you call for it. From this point forward, no one can be sure what will happen. Let's prepare ourselves before we summon Babel. The time has finally come. Are you prepared? All right. Feel the power of Bell within you and give yourself to its flow. That power will rock Babel awake, calling it here. Last song of the night. No encores, please. Hey, Jen. I wonder how much Aya knew. How much did she understand? I think she gave me this homework because she knew all of this was going to happen. Yeah. Regardless of the truth, I'm thankful for her. I'm thankful I met her. And for everything about her. Haru, after everything's said and done, let me listen to you sing. <laughs> Do you have a fever or something? You've always listened to me sing. <laughs> I know. But I want to hear it again. Don't lose focus until it's over. You don't even have to tell me. Never fear! Justice always wins! And we're not alone! It was a pretty inconvenient week, but it's almost over. This is the end! Let's do this! I won't think about wanting to run away. If I'm with all you guys, I'm not scared. And I believe in him. It's been a long journey. I'll finish this mission no matter what, Commander Fushimi. I'm sure Mr. Kresnik is wishing us the best, too. Let's give it our best shot. Yeah, let's end this lockdown. This is the demon summoning server our comps were connected to? Then... 
That's Babel! It seems so. This is the King's Gate. The proof of kingship that all the bells have sought. Babel. I thought it'd be more like a gate. Uh, I imagine something different. It's more like a tower than a gate. And it's huge! Too huge! <laughs> this is one hell of an audience. Do I just have to sing that song here? That is what Remiel tells me. If he closes the gate after the song is uploaded, all the demons will return to the demon realm, unable to return to our side. All right. I'll take care of uploading it to Babel. I'll give you a sign when it's time to sing. Hey, I've even got a conductor now. This is getting fun. I'll make this my best performance ever. Now, let the concert begin. See that over there? I think that's the console panel connected to Babel. Haru and I are gonna head there first. I see. So that's where I'll be singing? Yeah. Once I get to the console, I'll prep the upload and we'll go from there. All right. You said your name was Satsuro, right? I'll be following you, so you better be a good bodyguard. Haru and I have to go to the console in the middle. You never know what'll happen, so back us up.
See that over there? I think that's the console panel connected to Babel. Haru and I are gonna head there first. I see. So that's where I'll be singing? Yeah. Once I get to the console, I'll prep the upload and we'll go from there. All right. You said your name was Satsuro, right? I'll be following you, so you better be a good bodyguard. Haru and I have to go to the console in the middle. You never know what'll happen, so back us up.
I'm all set. What about you and the upload? console panel works, and the mic control is uh, right here. All right, I'm done getting the upload ready. Hey there, I've been waiting for you, Atsuboy. Is it fired up and ready to go? Atsuboy? Well, whatever works. Bring that sequencer here. All right. Okay, it's ready. Haru, let's trade places. Here we go, everyone. This concert goes out to Aya. Wow, that's a big face! Is Babel making it come out? Damn it, I just figured out what that is. It's Babel's defense program. <laughs> if we don't defeat it, the upload won't finish. No need to hold back, so crush it. Their numbers are growing! We can't handle this alone anymore! What? What's going on? The 
demons are disappearing? This is... Commander! The demons are disappearing one by one! What's going on? Yes, it's them! They made it in time! The demons are heading back to their own realm! Now we just have to close Babel. Hmm? Hey, the demons from your cops are going back too! It was a short time, but I'll never forget you. Someday, when you've taught the demons that it's okay to love, we'll be able to hang out again, right? And What's going on? Babel's acting kind of funny. the King's Gate. <laughs> this is it, guys. Magical or not, I'm Midori Kamaki. We'll bring peace back to Tokyo. We'll take it from here, Haru. Stay back so you don't get hurt. Yeah, I'll leave it to you. I'm not worried one bit because you can do it.
Did we do it? Babel is going back to the demon realm. Our peril has been averted. Yes! We did it! It's finally over. <sighs> Haru! I'm okay. It was just a high energy concert. We did it! So what's up with that expression? I would be laughing at you. <sighs> yeah, you're right. We finally did it. That was your best performance yet. I thought about giving up so many times, but those nightmarish days are over. Justice wins all the time, just as I've said. Although I'm good, but even without them, justice won't ever lose. In just seven days, humanity was tried and tested in every possible way. People must learn from this experience. That's the least we can do for those who lost their lives. Now that I think about it, it's only been seven days since the lockdown started. It feels more like months. What a long week. I can finally go home! Wow, my knees are shaking. Congratulations. Thanks to you, mankind has been saved. The power to enslave the world was yours, but you sacrificed that to protect the people. Most will never know what you did for them, but everyone here does. Thank you. Uh, I see. Men do not become kings after seizing power. They are kings to begin with. After today's trial, I understand clearly. It was not mere coincidence that you were able to defeat all of the Bells. One like you treads ever forward, no matter what obstacles or plagues may come. This is Sheba Park Unit 1. The structure that came from the sky is confirmed gone. Crisis averted. I repeat, crisis averted. This is HQ. We have confirmation as well. We're preparing to lift the lockdown. Stand by for orders. Over. Roger that, HQ. This is Unit 1, over and out. <sighs> they did it. That foul presence is gone. And the sky's back to good old blue. Those kids actually did it. Hmm. <laughs> I didn't predict an outcome like this. Discarding the power made both God and the demons withdraw, thus proving mankind's worth. But, I won't give up.